Hello everyone, welcome to another episode of The Admin Show. I'm your host, MarkBrin21. Today is the biggest episode of The Admin Show ever, because we are celebrating the birthday of Build-A-Bear Chief Executive, Maxine Clark. And who better to have on the show than Maxine herself? So, please, welcome to The Admin Show, Build-A-Bear Chief Executive, Maxine Clark. Hello Maxine, it's really great to have you on the show. Now before we get started, we'd just like to let everyone know that throughout the rest of this interview, we will not be using Maxine's voice. When Maxine is answering the questions, you'll hear Karen Bearhug's voice, as we are unable to use Maxine's voice. Okay, let's get started. So Maxine, what inspired you to start Build-A-Bear Workshop? I loved stuffed animals and my 10 year old friend Katie thought it would be fun to make your own stuffed animals. Katie is 24 today. Wow, that is great. So Maxime, we know there are a lot of Build-A-Bears out there now, but what is your absolute favourite Build-A-Bear? I love them all, but my husband gave me a curly teddy in 1998 and that is extra special to me. Aw, what a nice choice. So Maxime, what do you say to kids who want to start a very successful business when they're older, just like you did? Find your passion and make sure you get experience and do your research and go for it. Wow, thanks for the great advice. So who is your role model? I have so many role models, but probably my mom was my most important. She was very smart and very caring about others. Like most moms, she's always right too. Aw, that's nice. So what is it like to be the CEB of Build-A-Bear Workshop? It's lots of fun and lots of hard work. What are your hobbies outside of Build-A-Bear Workshop? I love to read and to help others. Great. So what plans do you have for your birthday? I will be in New York City to launch a special birthday program in the USA, cause for celebration with St. Jude's Children's Research Hospital. If it is successful, we will spread it to all countries. Wow, that sounds so exciting. Did you ever think Build-A-Bear Workshop would become what it is today? I wasn't sure, of course, but I was very hopeful it would be a big success. What inspired you to start Love Hug Smiles? Smiles is what we're all about. We want to be sure that our products and experiences make kids smile. The hugs are from our bears. They always inspire us, and the love is what makes us all feel special. Well, we're out of time for the interview, but thank you so much for coming, Maxine. It has really been a big honour to have you. Is there anything else you'd like to say to conclude this interview? Thanks to all of our forum members for all you do to make Build-A-Bear Workshop and Bearville famous. Thank you and goodbye. As a special gift for everyone watching, Maxine has given each of you a cool new badge for your online profile at bearvilleworld.com. Okay, after the break, we have a special performance from the Bear for World staff in honour of Maxine's birthday. And we also have some special birthday messages from build a celebrities. Stay tuned. Attention Bearville members, do you want to win some amazing prizes? If you do, then you should stop by bearvilleworld.com. Each day in the month of March, we'll be giving away a random code to one lucky active member of the form. Details at bearvilleworld.com forward slash win. Good luck. Okay, we're back, and now please welcome the Bear for World staff performing Birthday Bear. From the Birthday Bear, happy birthday.
Well, we're almost out of time for this episode, but before we go, we managed to catch up with some of the Bearville celebrities and they gave us some birthday messages just for Maxine. Well, that's it for this episode of The Admin Show. We hope you enjoyed it and we'll see you next time. Thanks for watching. Bye. And remember, you can check out our YouTube channel for any other episodes of The Admin Show and you can also subscribe to us by clicking the link below. Thanks for watching this episode of The Admin Show. Your feedback is very important to us, so be sure to leave us a comment on how you found this episode by clicking the link below.